Assalamu alaikum welcome to Nasir Soft. In this video I am going to show you how you can pre-process your textual data like tweets in Python uh, Jupyter Notebook. Okay so this is the my Jupyter Notebook and first of all we need to install some necessary library for this. For the uh, textual data pre-processing, I am using the NLTK library. So through the pip install NLTK command, you can install the uh, NLTK library. And we need uh, another library that is pandas for, for example, reading the CSV or Excel file. Okay. So through pip install pandas, you can install the panda. Okay. After that, we need to import the NLTK, some pre-processing RE for example, for regular expression and in my case so i have already downloading the all the necessaries library of nltk you can download the nltk dot download uh, method you can download all the nltk library and through this method that is nltk dot data dot path dot append and here you need to uh, path of that all basically uh, downloaded folder so inside my nltk all packages folder i have already downloaded so i just include this to this and from RLTK corpus, I import the stop words and word net. And uh, for example, uh, my uh, all the textual data or tweets data is in English language. So I am using the stop words, dot words English. And I all these stop, English stop words, I basically saved inside my variable that is stop words. And from NLTK tokenalize, I import the word tokenalize and stemming. I use this one. Okay. And I import the pandas as PD. Okay, if I execute this, here you can see that it will uh, basically import all these library. Then to, uh, we need to basically read the CSV file uh, that is inside my same directory that is chat dataset.csv. Okay, so if I go to that specific file in order to show uh, that is my uh, basically that uh, CSV file which we uh, basically include in this tutorial. And inside this file, you can see that inside the textual, uh, inside the text, that is capital T E X T. Okay, inside the text, all the tweets are. So we basically we will pre-processing this column. Okay, as you can see that there is at the rate sign and something like. Okay, so in this video I will show you how you can pre-process this data for the uh, other machine learning algorithms or sentiment analysis or something like which you like. Okay, so my focus was the pre-processing steps. You need the basic pre-processing step you need to do for the textual data in Python. So in this line, so basically through the panda pd dot read CSV, I include the uh, path of that CSV and uh, whatever it saved inside the data file. Okay. So here basically if I insert a new cell, for example, this through the insert, insert above and what is inside this data file, for example, if I execute it here, you can see that my all these uh, basically field from and the textual and all basically is uh, successfully it's saved inside the data file. Okay, so let's go further. For the first pre-processing step is removing the URL from the textual data. Okay, so through the data file text column, which is a main column that contains the tweets. Okay, so to this column, apply the lambda function and call this my uh, remove uh, URL method. Okay, and what the remove URL remove URL method says through the regular expression. So basically, it will remove the URL and return me this and save again inside this text column. Okay, so basically, it will replace the first text. Okay, to the after pre-process and removing the URL to this text. Okay, so if I execute this this line, you can see that now all the uh, URLs will be removing from this. Okay, so let's move to the second pre-processing step that is remove HTML. If the tweets have any HTML tag through this method that is remove HTML and through this regular expression, okay, it will remove the any HTML uh, tags from this data and save again from this uh, text column. Okay, so let's move to the third one. If we execute this, it is also executed. Third is removing the punctuation. Okay, so for example, sometime for sentiment analysis, there is no need for punctuation or something like so I make this lambda function and remove punch method and inside this method through this make transacts, it will basically remove the punctuation and save again to this text specific text column. 
okay after removing the uh, url after removing the html after removing the punctuation for example if i execute this two and here what will be my output if we again insert a new and show me the text column now here you can see that it's uh, at the rate sign is not present now and most of the text is now pre-processed and clean okay so let's move to the for that is tokenizing okay so tokenizing is very important so basically it will uh, basically uh, from the sentence it makes the tokens okay and for, for, through the nltk okay to, uh, for the column dot apply word tokenized okay when apply this word tokenize is basically tokenize this okay if i execute this it is still executing taking some time for tokenizing okay and after the execution if i insert a new uh, and here show me the output here you can see that now instead of sentence it tokenized each word okay so that's the five the fifth step is lower case okay so it will basically uh, each token uh, it will uh, replace to, to the lower case for example if some words are in uh, basically not in lower case or upper case something it will basically uh, it will basically uh, convert to the lower case in order to consider it the same words to the lambda word dot lower method okay it will convert this to the lower case if execute this and this is the most important step to stop words removing okay through the lambda method that uh, apply for this column word for word in x if word not in stop words as you can see that before this at the start of the uh, this video i show you the to inside the stop words that contains the english stop words so it will basically not in okay so it will basically remove the stop words from the tweets okay so stop words basically are not important uh, for us you know for the pre-processing uh, so therefore inside the pre-processing step we remove the stop words if we execute this and for example what will be the output after executing this if I again execute this here you can see that all the ibm is on lower case and stop words are removing okay so after removing the stop words the second pre-processing step is applying parts of speech okay so to the nltk dot tags dot parts of speech okay so if i execute this saved again the inside the text column okay uh, as you can see that the parts of speech as it will show me the uh, number of nouns number of pronouns adverbs each and everything okay so after executing this i will show you the output after applying the post of text okay if i insert here a new oh sorry below so delete this one delete this cell and after this below what will be the output okay is it static sign it means that it's still executing okay so what will be the output now is can you see that in the, word, uh, the first verb is and then it means the noun the file is vbd that is uh, i don't know what is vbd so in the next step i will show it to you okay so for example the pre-processing step eight is word net prop for example, if the tag start with J, then write the adverb, something it, it is for us, okay? For example, if I execute this, you will understand about what is NN, what, what something like, okay? So if I executing this and the it, okay? So basically, it will uh, tell this, for example, if the J, J mean adverb, V means verb, N means noun, R means adjective, okay? So after this, if I insert a new, uh, tab and show me the output of this after executing this you can see that ibm is noun file is verb okay and something like okay so this is the get word night uh, through this method we will basically uh, adding the adverb verb and something like okay and the last step is lemmatization okay what is lemmatization for to basically uh, to give me the root of every word okay in lemmatization that exists in the dictionary okay so if i execute this you can see that now this method lambda wlt dot lemmatize it will basically basically lemmatize the each word and what will be the output for example after the lemmatization here you can see that the, it again sentence this this command we again sentence this and the ibm file and people and all these uh, tweets are now lemmatized okay so now these are the uh, basics 
pre-processing steps which need to be done for the sentiment analysis, for the emotion analysis, for the basically applying the different machine learning algorithms on the textual data. So hope uh, you will understand about all these pre-processing steps and this code is mentioned in video description link. You can just copy and paste this link. Don't worry. And if you have any question regarding to this topic uh, in the video uh, comment section, in the video description section, okay, your question or link is mentioned or you can email me. I will answer it to you. Don't forget to subscribe my channel Nasir Soft. Okay, and uh, the nasirsoft.com is also exists. So you can just go and register yourself. Uh, you, you can um, you can directly message me through my website. Okay, have a nice day.